Hey everyone, it's Spencer and Taylor with Nexus coming to you today from Lake Taboo, as you can see from behind us here, bringing you our September check-in today. And we know you guys just started school up again. We hope you guys are all settled in, ready for a great school year. We'll be starting our classes here for product success this week. We have a couple starting this week uh, in junior highs and high schools. And then also very soon we have our Botvin classes starting up again at the elementary schools as well. Now this month we want to talk to you guys a little bit about something that's a little more serious but really important to us. It's Suicide Prevention Awareness Month. And we understand this topic can be difficult for some people to speak on, but we think it's really important to bring awareness to it because bringing awareness and just talking about it can help to save someone's life. Suicide Prevention Awareness Month is, is a whole month dedicated to let those know that they're not alone in their struggles and there's people like Spencer and I there to talk and listen when people are needed. Um, it's a whole month dedicated to let those know that they are not alone in their struggles and there's people that are there that will listen and help them through their struggles. Um, if not on campus, in our offices, um, stuff like that. If you do need anybody um, and you see us on campus, we, um, reach out to us, come up to us. We're always there, open ear to listen. Um, we'll be on all the campuses in Amador, junior high, high school, and elementary. If you see us, come up to us and say hi. Yeah. So really guys, uh, Suicide Prevention Awareness Month is really about hope. Bringing people hope that there is the light at the end of the tunnel. You know, sometimes people feel like there's no other way out, there's no hope for them. We want them to understand there's light there. They can get through the, these tough times. They can make it through and they have a support system whether or not they know it. You know, some people do believe that they don't have a support system, there's nobody around them that can support them. We can be that support system. That's what we're here for. That's what we do. We want you guys to understand there's hope. We want you guys to help, uh, help you guys understand the different signs and symptoms of somebody who may be thinking about um, making an attempt on their life like this. And through that, one of the things we do is our QPR trainings. QPR is Question, Persuade, and Refer. It's a suicide prevention training that essentially gives you all the tools you need to help somebody who may be in a mental health crisis get to a professional to help them out. So we'll be doing two of those trainings this month. The first one will be on the 21st. It's gonna be at 4 p.m. at our Upcountry Community Center. We'll have the address and everything in the description of our video. The second one's gonna be on the 28th, also at 4 p.m. This one will be on Zoom. I will put a link to our Zoom, to the Zoom class in the uh, description as well so you guys can get to it through there. Or to, if you wanna register, you can call me, 209-257-1980, extension 116. Call me and I'll get you on the list. Or you can email me. My email is sduts at nexusyfs.org. Just send me an email, tell me which, one, which train you wanna sign up for, and we'll get you in for that. Also, I want to let you guys know that on the campuses this year, both campuses with the high schools, we'll be doing what's called a peer plus group. Essentially, it's a peer support group for students to be there and have, so students have somebody of their own age to go and talk to about things that maybe they're not comfortable talking to their close friends about or any of their teachers about. So ask around campus about our peer plus program as well. And like Taylor said earlier, if you guys see us around, feel free to come up and talk to us, say hi, ask us questions about our programs, ask us questions about what's going on with us, what, we have, what we're doing on the campus, anything like that. We're always willing to talk to you guys. And as always, guys, stay healthy and stay safe.